My name is Tim Tevelde. I'm a captain for KLM on the Boeing 747. I've been doing this for 27 years now. Today we're going to the beautiful island of St. Maarten, which is very interesting for us as it has a very short runway and some hills around the airport. We're here at the cruise center and we're going to prepare for the flight plan. For today, we have our flight to St. Maarten and Curaçao. We're flying south of the tracks. Uh, we have some weather in this area. It might give us some turbulence. And after that, it's clear, huh? Looks good. We saw the forecast for uh, Antigua, our alternate, and the weather in St. Maarten. All looks great, chance of a shower, clear skies for the rest. So we shouldn't have any problems there. Agree? Yep. The aircraft is okay. We are at gate F6. No technical things. No special cargo. And these are the weights. We have a low zero fuel weight today. Eight hours and 50 minutes flying with 85 tons. So now, about the fuel. Do you agree on the fuel proposed by dispatch? Yes. There's no reason to take any more? I think so too. Okay. Well, if we agree on the fuel, the weather is good, the aircraft is good, the route is checked, then we'll go for it. Yeah? Excellent. Okay. Okay. That's it. Now, now we're going to program the FMS for our route to St. Maarten. These are the preset parameters with drag factors and all that maintenance stuff. This is our position. We check this with our actual position. And GPS is also providing us with the position. Our route today is from Amsterdam to St. Maarten. Takeoff runway, flight number. And we can uh, select our departure on the departures page. Runway 24, and then we'll go for a Volco 1 share departure, as expected. Here it is. Then you can go to legs page. See on your nav display whether the right procedure is selected and then you can execute it. Then it becomes magenta and that's the route we can couple the autopilot to. This is the magenta route. Now we proceed, we're today flying a cost index of 150. Our reserves today, we take it from the flight plan. This is our fuel amount we use as a final reserve. And our cruising altitude will initially be level 320. We made a calculation for performance today. We derate the engines a little bit to save fuel. I will depart with a flaps 20 on a dry runway and the speeds are also calculated on 140 for V1, 154 to rotate and 164 for V2. Our trim today is calculated on the load sheet, will be 26% and that results it's calculating in a trim setting and we'll see that later on. On the fix page, we check if there are fixes. On the Navrat page, we check if Schiphol is tuned because we need the Schiphol DME for our procedure. Here's the Schiphol DME. So that's basically our setup, and soon we'll be ready to fly. Preparation checklist. checklist. The uh, pre-flight checklist. Complete. Circuit breaker. Complete. Dank. Geef ons nog één minuutje alstublieft. Ja, zeker. Rustig aan. Oxygen.
Tested 100%. Tested 100%. Gear pins stowed. Serviceability checked. It's checked. Parking brake. It's released. Flight instruments. Blank Toga Toga. El Nafina staat er al op. Achterrade. Heading 256. Checked hier. Fuel control switches. Cut off. Dat is de pre-flight checklist complete. Oké. Okay. Nederwaartse, achterwaartse helemaal klaar? Ja. Okay. Delivery KLM 785. Ready for start -up. KLM 785, goedemorgen. As corrective. Uh, Start-up is approved. U bent nummer 3 daar. Zo so expect a little more delay. But call it 1218 now. Start-up approved. We we'll expect delay in 1218. KLM 785. We zijn er maar drie uh, voor start-up, dus nog uh, even geduld graag. Ja, we hebben geen probleem. Crewbriefing? Ja. Ik zal even melden bij Ground, als we klaar zijn. Ja. Ground KLM 785, we are ready for push at uh, Fox 6. 785, hello, Delta behind you when he is clear, push pull approved. When we're clear of the Delta behind us, push pull approved. KLM 785. Delta, push pull, okay. Clue briefing. We do start startup during pushback, waarschijnlijk into Alpha 114 and then Alpha 16 around to Alpha. To Alpha 7 or, or Sierra 7 or Sierra 6. We catered for both, so it will probably be Sierra 7. We have one hotspot we're crossing, so there we have our eyes outside. Then we'll do the Falco and Sierra departure, which says that after 40 dB of Schiphol, we have to go left, it's set here, and then pick up the radial outbound 251 from Pampus as selected. The transition is 3,000 feet and the first altitude level 6-0. Our sector for this departure is 1,700 feet. The weather is good for departure, we have no special no temps on Schiphol and the technical status of the aircraft is okay for this departure. I will do probably a first turn hand flying, it's beautiful weather, it's not too busy and then we'll uh, select the autopilot. If that's okay for you? Do you have any questions on the briefing? Okay, they were ready to go. Hello, ground. After the Delta has vacated, we are cleared for a push pull. Delta, it's on the just now commencing. Push. Commencing pushback. Okay. Slides? Yeah. Zeg jij maar. Kevin Crew, arm slides. Slide deck door. Closed and locked. Fuel. Checked. Passenger signs set. MCP. 1642360 on set. Take off speed. V1 140. V1 140. V rotate 154. V rotate 154. V2 164. V2 164. CDU pre flight. Complete. Trims. Zero, zero, almost. Dan ga ik iets aan sleutelen. 5.0 set. Crew briefing. Complete. Beacon lights. Both. Four star checks, complete. Het leider, ik start 4, 3, 2, 1. Roger, start 4, 3, then 2, 1. Start 4 and 3. Start 4 and 3. Push back completed, set park bricks, please. Parking brakes are set. You may disconnect. Thanks for your help. You're welcome. Disconnecting. Hold position. Wait for the visual signal at your left hand side and enjoy your flight. We'll wait for a visual on the left hand side. Good night. Stabilize. Start two and one. Start two and one.
And stabilized. Okay, before taxi checklist. Uh, Flaps 20. Is die al clear? Weg is. Right, it's clear. Flaps 20. Flaps 20. Aileron. Right. Three up, two down. Left. Three up, two down. Two down. And neutral. Checked. Before taxi checklist. Before taxi checklist. APU. Off. Anti ice. Auto recall. Checked. Auto brakes. RTO. Flap lever. 20. Flight controls. Checked. Ground equipment. Clear. Before taxi checklist complete. Ground KLM 785, request exit. KLM 785, taxi runway 24, Sheriff 7, first right, your number one for Alpha. First right, number one for Alpha, taxi runway 24, Sheriff 7, KLM 785. Right, right clear, clear, left clear, here we go. Seven KLM seven eight. Kevin ready. Kijk eens aan. Mooi. Kevin crew, take your seats. KLM 785, Sierra 7, uh, we are ready for the boat. KLM 785, line up and wait, runway 24. Line up and wait, runway 24, KLM 785. Okay, confirm, Sierra 724, cleared line up. Affirm. Finals clear. Before takeoff checklist. Before takeoff checklist. Cabin ready. Received. Pex. Normal. Flaps. 20. Before takeoff checklist. Complete. Cleared to take off, KLM 785. Cleared. Check. Take off. Thrust set.
Flaps 10. Flaps 10. Departure KLM 785 out of 2012. 785, Speed is ours. Climb to 60. KLM 785. Flaps 5. Flaps 5. One. Flaps one. Heading two seven zero. Okay, I'm seven eight five. So heading select. Heading select. Heading two seven zero. Flaps up. Flaps up. Flaps are up. Set out a pilot. Command. Speed feet of alt for Check. six zero. Check. Check. Flight level one three zero. KLM seven eight five. One three zero. Trust draft feet of speed. Check. After take of checklist. After take of checklist. Empty eyes. Auto. Direct ref so KLM 785. Direct ref so. Check. Check. Hell enough. Check. After take of checklist. Anti ice auto landing gear up flaps up after take of checklist. 1575 KLM 785 bedankt tot ziens. Amsterdam KLM 785 out of fly level 9 or 5. Climb fly level 130. Climb fly level 240 KLM 785. 240. Checked. Speed 346. Dat is een mooie snelheid. Moeten we met de klaring aan de slag, hè? Ja. De route staat er volgens mij tot Banma pas in, hè? Ja. We hebben nog even Adara erbij. Even kijken, 7, 26. 42. Ja, hij kan er al uit. Ja, hè? We're going to do the Oceanic Clearance. KLM designed a special page for this. It's set here. You push the prompt, and then now we're going to request the clearance at the Shenwick ATC. Our entry point today is Adara. So I will put that in here. The ETA for Adara will be 08. Four one Zulu. Our flight number KLM seven eight five. We're requesting to cross at the level of three two zero and a speed of Mach decimal eight six. You could enter some optional free text, and today we will say Max flight level for us will be three six zero. The only thing we have to do now is press send and then we'll get an automatic ACARS reply whether this is granted or not. Random route via Adara, 50 yep. north 20 west, 45 north 30 west, 39 north 40 west, 35 north 45 west, 31 north 50 west, 27 north 55 west. 2-2 north and 6-0 west. Check. From Adara. Maintain. 320 mach 86. Oké, okay. fly level 320. Ja. Check. Dat is conform hè? Ja, boven het flight level. Ja, maar die gaan we wel krijgen straks. 
Zal ik hem erin gaan zetten? Ja. Your controls. My controls. The complete route is in now. Can you check it? Your controls. My controls. On ACARS we received our data link clearance. We inserted this into the FMS and now we're ready to cross the Atlantic. We'll see you back approaching St. Martin. Welcome back. We are at 22 North and 60 West to be exact. We did our oceanic crossing and soon we're going to prepare for the approach in uh, Juliana International Airport at uh, Sint Maarten. Sint Maarten has a relatively short runway and some hills surrounding the airport, which is very interesting for us. So we'll do a thorough preparation for a safe approach. Dames, our clearance is uh, Obaiki at level 280. It's pre-selected and we'll descend to 100 miles at our new top of descent. Then we'll follow the Arnaf sit, uh, Arnaf arrival to Manolo and ultimately to Avaki. Avaki is here on the approach chart. This is the Arnav GNSS for runway 10. Avaki we have to be at 2600 feet, it's 10.2 DME out. The FMS is programmed to be there at 2600 or above at 200 knots. Then we'll approach with Elna Finev until we take over manually. Landing, out of brakes four. Standard reverse and flaps 30. If you don't make it, the go around via the missed approach point Maypan, then a right turn towards Ambed climb to 4000 feet. Maximum speed in this procedure is 205 knots. This is to guarantee our 700 feet decision altitude for this procedure. Then we'll approach the runway with a 100 feet displaced threshold, 100 meters displaced threshold and a 2245 meter wide runway. Equipped with phases and we have uh, no slope. Our calculated landing distance is a bit less than 1700 meters. So we should be at the still stop somewhere here. Make a right turn back to Charlie Taxiway and there we'll enter the apron and probably be parked at Alpha 1, which is a fixed gate. The threats for this approach are of course distraction during the final approach part and the short landing runway distance. We also have to be careful entering the platform for other aircraft being around us. I don't know how busy this will be. And the turning at the end with minimum power of course. And let's see how many spectators we have at the fence here. The notams for this airport are not relevant for our approach. We have no relevant technical items. The weather is beautiful as you can see outside. QNH 1017 is preset, as is the decision altitude, 700 feet. But we won't need that one today with the visual approach for the last part, probably. For the rest, did I leave anything out? Any questions? Anything else? Then we have the transition level is 65, and the sectors are based on Papa Juliet Mike and the 4100 is here so not very relevant for our approach the island has 2600 yeah, only if we completely lost our way we should be up to 4100 if we have to divert we have to also incorporate our fuel status in our decisions we are as planned now so that means that we can wait until eight tons before we have to divert to uh, Antigua. The fuel is divided neatly, so it's all usable. And we have six tons to go to land. All right, we have to check officially, but we're official today. We have to check our uh, uh, RNF capabilities, of course, actual uh, and uh, preset. One mile now, 0.3 later. Yeah. Okay, monitor the brake temperatures. I think that covers it. Any more threats? No. 
Okay, thank you very much. That was it. Okay. Uh, descent checklist. Recall checked. Auto brakes. Four set. Landing data. The decision height 700 feet. VF 139 and 1017 preset. Tour briefing. Complete. Descent checklist complete. Eight point seven, Kelly seven eighty five. Good day. We are on the tower. Good day, KLM seven eighty five. We are descending out of flight level uh, two hundred, flight level one six. Expect uh, further descent after Manalo and the Arnav approach for runway 10, yeah, 785. Maar dat betekent dat we tot Manolo level gaan vliegen dus. Yeah. But if we expect further clearance after Manolo, then it's busy because he's keeping us high, eh? It's uh, 47, 48 miles from Manolo. Flight level 160, dat uh, zou nog wel uh, mooi uitkomen toch? Dat is niet heel hoog. Vina valt. Check. We're already on a tower frequency, which is typical for this area because they don't have a very layered ATC system. So from San Juan, we were directly transferred to St. Marta Tower. Tower KLM 785, uh, can we follow the uh, Arnav approach uh, after Manolo? Direct Atmut for the uh, Arnav approach, and uh, can we descend? KLM 785, descend 2600, QH 3005. Descend 2600, 3005. KLM 785. Okay, 45 track miles, we're done with the we kunnen wel naar uh, 3005. Yeah. Zullen we proost checklist doen? Is goed. Kevin Crew, prepare for landing. Uh, approach checklist. Altimeters 3005. Passing to 3. 13700. Check. Approach checklist. Ik kom een beetje hoog uit, denk ik. Ik ga hem nu even trekken. Ja. ja? Als we het pad niet op tijd hebben, dan wil ik even door. Anders krijgen we een rust approach. Uh... Ja. Er zit ook geen hol op hier. Clear the RNF approach 1-0, report the lessor, KLM 7-8-5. Doen we flaps 1. Flaps 1. Flaps 5. Flaps 
Hij moet hier op Avaki op 200 zijn, hè, de snelheid. Flaps 5, flaps 10. Flaps 10. Gear down. Gear down. <coughs> Flaps 20. Flaps 20. Speed Finna Veltitude. Check. Baan is See the runway? Ja. Autopilot off, auto swaddle off. Set 20 mark. Speed 20 mark. Even cabine. Cabin crew, take your seats. Lean your seats. Okay. Flaps 30. Flaps 30. Kunnen wij nog een vinaf pad krijgen op een of andere manier? Ja, daar is die. Oh, daar is die. Vinaf pad. Set VRF plus 5. Kilam 785, runway 10, wind 09 and 012 Clear to land, Kilam 785. Landing checklist, take your seats, announce speed brake. Armed. Landing gear. Down. Flaps. 30. Landing checklist, complete. Check. Clear to land. Check. Even. Check. Approaching minimums. Cleared. Check. Minimums. Landing. Check. Breaking.
de EPU maar vast staat. Ja, goed idee. Delta coming up. Ja. Dat zou de volgende Charlie moeten zijn, hè? Correct. En de parking stand voor KLM 785. This arm slides. Cabin crew, doors may be opened. Shut down checklist. <laughs> the shut down checklist. Hydraulic panel to go, fuel pumps off. Flaps up. Fuel control switches. Cut off. Beacon lights off. Weather radar off. And here. Doors may be opened. And out. Parking brake. To go. Goedemorgen, meneer. Shots out of play is the brakes can be released. Release the parking brakes, no technicals. Released. Hydraulic panel set and the parking brake release shutdown checklist complete. Okay. That was him. Jammer van die wolken naar final, hè? Eh? 